With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Well, hello students. Now we're going to see this question. The question says that a harmonically moving transverse wave on a string has maximum particle velocity and acceleration of 3 meter per second and 90 meter per second square respectively. The velocity of the wave is 20 meter per second and the waveform. Okay, find the waveform. Okay, so basically we need to find the function of the wave. Okay, means the equation of the wave. Waveform means we need to find the equation of wave. Got it. So basically we are going to use the, these things that basically firstly it's given that V max means maximum velocity is given as what 3 meter per second and we know that maximum velocity in a harmonic motion is what it is given by A into omega where A is the amplitude and omega is the angular velocity. Okay. Similarly A max which is maximum acceleration is given as 90 meter per second square. Okay. It is also denoted as A omega square. Okay. So if we consider these two, two equations, name it 1 and name it 2. And what we do is that we do 2 divided by 1. Okay. That will give us a, the value of omega. Okay. So when we do 2 divided by 1, we will have omega will be equal to what? Omega will be 90 divided by 3. Okay. So this 90 divided by 3 which will come out to be as 30 okay so basically this will be 30 uh, omega will be 30 radians per second okay so we are gonna leave it like this since we got omega so what we'll do now we'll put this value in this equation to find out a okay so from 1 okay so uh, in 1 what we have is that a omega is equal to 3 meter per second square so we will put the value of omega a into 30 must be equal to 3 so from here what we'll get a will be equal to 0 0.1 meters got it so basically we got everything a and omega okay and a general form of wave is what y equals a sine omega t plus minus kx okay this is the general form of the wave okay where k is what k is very easy k is what basically k is given by k is given by omega divided by okay it is given by omega divided by wave velocity which is v okay so omega was found to be what 30 and wave velocity was found to be 20 so this will come out to be as 1.5 okay so basically from here if we put the value y will be equal to a which is the amplitude which is 0 0.1 sine omega which is 30 t plus minus k which is 1.5 into x okay so basically if you see this is the final waveform that is found okay and basically this is our required answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today